now we can look at question 31. Extract E, line 1 and 2 states, Panache is one of the three main fertilizer products which farmers use to increase their output before planting crops such as wheat. Explain the possible effect on the market for wheat of a fall in the price of a fertilizer such as potash. If there's a decrease in the price of potash, then it decreases the cost of production for farmers. This makes it cheaper for farmers to supply wheat to the market as one of their factor of, produ factor of production as fertilizer has decreased in price. This means that farmers will be more willing to supply more of this good to the market and this is represented by a shift in the supply curve shifting outwards. We'll draw a demand fairly inelastic here and supply also fairly inelastic. So our supply curve, because potash has decreased in price, the supply curve shifts outwards. And our firms are willing to supply more to the market. So we'll just put price here and quantity here. Our initial equilibrium was here at point E1. This is where we had price 1 and quantity 1. Our new equilibrium is here at E2. And this is at price P2 and Q2. So the effect in the market would be to decrease the price of wheat and to increase the quantity of output. We have a decrease quantity. Increase quantity. This massively increases the amount of consumer surplus. Before our consumer surplus was this area here, whereas now it includes this area and also this area as well because our consumers are willing to pay their demand curve but they're actually only paying P2 however the decrease in price depends on how elastic and inelastic the demand curve is here I have chosen to draw on to draw a demand fairly inelastic because demand for food well demand for wheat you wouldn't expect that to change too much too much over a price because you only need to consume so much whereas if it was drawn more elastic then the price decrease would not be as much I'll just draw it quickly here so we've got P Q so we've got S1 S2 demand p1 p2 this decrease in price is much less than this decrease in price but there is a greater increase in quantity here also another thing that needs to be considered is how much the price of potash makes well is in proportion to the cost of production for making wheat if it only has a tiny percent percent of the farmers cost of production then the supply curve would actually only shift marginally across so it could be something like that and then if that is the case there would only be a small decrease in price however if potash makes up a large amount of the cost of production for farmers then we would see that supply would shift a lot more across to the right as one S2 and we would see a greater fall in the price level.